My name is Jade Yuan, I'm 21 years old. I'm representing the UK in the Eurovision Song Contest. My song is called It's My Time. It was composed by Andrew Lloyd Webber and the lyrics were written by Darren Warren. Um, it's a ballad and it's a passionate, emotive song that just talks about a journey. This year I think the UK have decided to take it a bit more seriously because we haven't done so well in recent years. We've definitely taken a new approach so we've been doing the European tour and we've had a record label backing and Andrew writing the song. Um, hopefully to try and prove to the rest of Europe that we do care about the contest and it is serious to us so hopefully it pays off. I loved working with Andrew and we still work very closely together at the moment, I see him a lot. Um, he's just really passionate about music and that's the thing that we share you know, in common. I love music, I love singing. He wrote the song but it was based with you know, the contestants in mind at the time. But um, I was also able to put my own spin on it and my own interpretation and do something at the end which I thought was great because then it became my own too. We're hoping that Andrew will join me in Moscow. He hasn't confirmed anything yet but I would love for him to be there because I think it would really help. I was elected to represent United Kingdom. Um, I started on a show called Your Country Needs You, which was a live show. Each week we performed and the nation had to vote for whoever they wanted to represent us. So I was the winner of that. Well, I've heard Malta's song before and I thought she was really good. Chiara, I always loved her song. I think it's a really good song. Um, also, Bosnia's song was the first time I'd heard it and that was Be My Valentine and I say that surprised me just because of the, the whole performance and the stage and she's very animated when she performs. How can you not like Andrew Lloyd Webber's song for example? Even the name is a very heavy name so you have to like it. Oh, that's really lovely of her. I'm flattered that she said that and she's lovely too. I saw her in Malta. It was the first time I did a performance after winning the show. So I saw her win her show there. And from the beginning, I was like, she's going to win. She's going to win. I thought she was great. So she's lovely. <laughs> I've been down, down so long. But those days are gone low. I've got the will. I've earned the right to show you it's my time tonight. It's my time, it's my time, my moment. I'm not gonna let Yes, I've heard other songs. Um, I was in Amsterdam two days ago. Yeah, and we had you know t about 25 representatives from each country there, so I heard a lot of songs. And gosh, the competition is so strong. Everybody's songs are so good. I just can't tell which way it's going to go this year. No, I haven't chosen the dress yet. We've chosen the designer. She's a British designer called Amanda Wakeley. Um, she's working on sketches and designs at the moment. And when I go back, actually, the end of next weekend, I'll have my first fitting. So, yeah, I will see the dress for the first time. <laughs> I do like Eurovision. I grew up watching Eurovision from really young and my earliest memories are dancing in front of the TV when I was really, really small watching the Eurovision Song Contest. Um, well, my favourite song was Gina G, who I just a little bit, because I just like that song. But my sort of inspiration, um, you know, for my career, I'd say is Celine Dion. She's my all-time favourite because she started out in the Eurovision and she's gone on to have global success and she has an amazing voice. The UK hasn't done very well for a long time. Um, I do actually 100% believe in the song. It's got a great composer. Hopefully people appreciate me as a vocalist and as a singer. And hopefully they see that I'm taking it seriously. So just vote for the song if you like it. Hi, I'm Jade from UK and you're watching Eurovision.tv.